Here comes the queen, the franchise, and the self-proclaimed opportunity. The following contest is an eight-woman ladder match. Making her way to the ring from the Queen City, the SmackDown Women's Champion, Charlotte Flair. You know, the WWE Universe, at least many in it, believe that she's been handed title opportunities in main events. Well, many of those same doubters live in their parents' basements, Cole. I wouldn't yeah. necessarily value their opinion. This is Charlotte Flair. This is the queen. Oh, this no. is the opportunity. Yeah. So, Byron, from your parents' basement, what do you feel about Charlotte Flair? First of all, I moved out last week, Michael. And second of all, I do think Charlotte's ego can be a bit out of control at times. After everything Charlotte Flair has accomplished in her career, her ego is allowed to be as big as it possibly can be. She's got an amazing robe. Saxton, how have you not learned by now? You need to open the ropes for the queen. Corey, haven't you heard? I'm no longer on robe duty. Oh, I didn't get that memo. Guys, I guess we can say welcome to Alexa's playground. And from Columbus, Ohio, Alexa Bliss. Corey, I got some breaking news. Alexa actually wants Byron as a guest on Alexa's playground tonight. Oh, thank God. I thought she'd never ask. Uh, guys, actually, I have a dinner date with my mom. I, I won't be available. And Saxton isn't the only person crying for their mommy on the arrival of Alexa Bliss. Byron, is the old Alexa still in there? I mean, I'm kind of wondering, but I don't really want to find out myself. And she seems happy. And she's also about to turn the ring into her own personal playground. From Montreal, Quebec, Canada, Maurice. Maurice had one of the longest championship reigns of all time. An A-lister in her own right. Why does Maurice always feel it's necessary to inform the world that they're not allowed in her personal space? Because Maurice feels necessary to inform the entire world that they're not as good as she is. Well, there's a humble attitude. It's a sad facts of life, Saxton. She has a very questionable attitude. There's nothing to question, Byron. Dana Brooke is in action. From Cleveland, Ohio, Dana Brooke. Dana Brooke, certainly one of the hardest workers in the women's division, always trying to learn new skills and techniques to better her game.
There's no doubt she has beauty. There's no doubt she has power, but she also has brains. Did you guys know that Dana Brooke has never lost a match on the same day that Byron Saxton had a date? Really? That's right. Amazing Byron, stats. when was your last date? None of your business. Exactly. Seen Russian has been ridiculed and written off her entire career, but here tonight she's looking to have the last laugh Go! and crush the competition. Well, anybody that's ever ridiculed Lana doesn't know what they're talking about. She's incredibly beautiful, Byron. incredibly talented. Byron speaks like 31 languages. Byron. Byron has none of those things. Well, I know, but Byron's criticized I, all those things. I did not. That's not true. I respect Lana. She is ready for this big match, and she knows everyone backstage will be watching her make an impact. Enter the Empress. <laughs> Nobody makes an entrance quite like Asuka. And from Osaka, Japan, Asuka! Asuka marches to her own drum in life and in the ring. A lethal striker. By the time her opponent knows what hit him, it's too late. You know, I really missed Oscar. You guys get it? Missed? I think I might vomit green liquid after that joke, Saxton. The nightmare is real. Rash, bold, and unashamed. Brutality has arrived. And from Adelaide, Australia, one half of the Women's Tag Team Champions, Rhea Ripley. The first ever woman to hold the NXT UK Championship has gone on to hold the NXT Women's Championship and the Raw Women's title. Now let's not forget the first NXT competitor to ever put their title on the line at WrestleMania. You know, some would call this confidence, others arrogance. That's the look on the face of Rhea Ripley. What we do know is that Rhea Ripley is always prepared for any kind of fight. One of the most inspirational superstars around. Oh, uh, one of my personal favorites, almost a superhero, Nikki A.S.H. How appropriate, Saxton, because you're almost a commentator. That wasn't funny, Corey. And from Glasgow, Scotland, one half of the Women's Tag Team Champions, almost a superhero, Nikki A.S.H. 
Listen, guys, I'll, I'll admit it. The change in attitude recently has brought Nikki A.S.H. a lot of success. Wait, Corey, does that mean you're ready to jump on the bandwagon of Nikki A.S.H.? Absolutely A. not. Well, the change in attitude of Nikki A.S.H. has certainly helped. No, she's won the Money in the Bank, the Raw Women's Championship, and the Women's Tag Titles. I think we're going to see even more super heroics here tonight. When people talk about ladder matches, they sometimes forget that subterfuge can play a part. Right, Byron? Absolutely. If you can't incapacitate your opponent long enough to set up and climb the ladder, perhaps you can distract them. Or whatever it takes to get the job done. Of course, I prefer it when they incapacitate them, but hey, I'm old school that way. When a chance for the title is away from the top of the ladder, you use whatever strategy works, guys. Nikki comes out delivers the cross body. A lot of chaos in a ladder match. How overwhelming does that get in the moment? It can't be overstated. But the key to winning a ladder match is to keep yourself calm. Do your best to control the moment. This way, it doesn't control you. There it is. Insulting.
shoves it and reverses it. That's just hard to watch. Asuka really came out on the wrong end of that exchange. Asuka finding herself in some serious trouble here. She's close now. One tug could do it. I don't know, Michael. It just doesn't appear to be coming down. here as her opponent is quickly finding out. Oh, look at just... Early to back suplex. No! Kick to the spine. How insulting is that?
And now she's looking to go top rope. We all know what she's looking to do next. And let's He's really out of it. She might be done soon. Oh, man. They're meeting the ball. Um, in the world of Roman, this is what we call it. Got the leg. Swinging neck breaker connects. Working the midsection there. Steve 
chair? Something we all know can be a devastating weapon. Got the single arm under him. Got a suplex. Alexa Bliss, man. Team out. Come on, that breaker. <laughs> Big deep right hand right across the legs. Solid connection. <laughs> Gotta find a way to get out of this. Bliss sent flying to the outside. Get slammed down. Carefully. Float over. Oh, and it would oh, oh, DDT. Making the climb here, guys. Oh, enough already. Here she goes. Can she grab? What good pull, and this match is over. Oh, it's not that easy, Saxton. It's a matter of time. 
Miz can taste victory now. Grabs it, and the ladder match is over. And now here's another look at what made the Money in the Bank match such a memorable one. Here is your winner, Charlotte Flair! The ultimate reward is worth all the risks. It really was an incredible battle for that career-altering briefcase.